Hey, this is part 3 for the Aceto Corsa server setup using Proximity Chat. So it uses an open source program called Mumble. Link in the description. You're going to be downloading the Windows Client x64 and the Windows Server x64. I already have my client downloaded, but I'm going to show you the server side first. And for that, I'm going to use a virtual machine. So navigate to where you installed your Mumble server. And if you double click this, it will do nothing. And that's because when installing on Windows, the INI file doesn't actually generate. So you have to go to this PC, Users, Administrator, or whatever user you're using it as. There's a hidden folder, App Data. If you can't find the folder, you can also do percent app data percent. But if you want to see it, go into Options, Change Folder, View, Show Hidden Files. Go into the Local and create a new folder named Mumble. Same as this one. Inside of it, you're going to create a new folder. M-U-R, M-U-R, Murmur. And then you're going to right click, Create New, Text Document create murmur.ini and then take out the .txt so now you're going to have a blank file and it's going to be the configuration settings for your server these are the bare bone I believe minimum for starting the server. If you want to find more commands to have more customability, go to the main page, scroll down to this link. This doesn't lead anywhere, it doesn't have any files that you can download, so you have to make it yourself, but it has a list of different commands you could put or specifications that you want for your server. But here's the main ones we're going to be using. You want to put your registered home as your public IP address. For this one, I'm going to be using this IP. But for you, it would be a different IP address. Use your own name, your registered name. Make sure you put your registered password. And leave your server password blank if you want the server to be publicly seen. So if you have the application open, there'll just be a list of servers, public servers you could join. If you don't want to be part of that list, put a password. I'll put this link in the description. You can make the file yourself or you can download it, either one. Once you have that INI file, just start it. Now we're going to be joining from here, but we have to do some setups. First go and you're going to go through the auto wizard when you first install this. But go into the cog, make sure all your settings are good. Go into audio output, positional audio, enable headphones, minimum distance up to 20, maximum distance. You can put it to, I would say 40 to 47. That seems to be a good uh, range minimum volume from 1% to 5% bloom the same press apply go into plugins link to game and transmit position you want to click this have it on go down scroll until you find a link and then enable it on the left side click apply after that you want to connect to the server that you made by adding new and put the IP address that you're hosting it off of. If you're hosting it off of your main computer, then it would be your public IP address. If it's on a virtual desktop somewhere else, you would put that IP address. You also need to enable this port. I'm not gonna go over how to port forward, but it should just be enabling one port, uh, UDP, TCP, and that's it. And once you're able to do that, just click connect and you're in. 
Another important thing is to remember that if you want to use this, you have to start this program before you start a Seto server. So if you're already in a Seto server and you're trying to use this, it won't work. That's just a small little thing that you need to keep in mind. As well as port forwarding is very specific to your internet provider and router. So how you do that will be kind of specific to you. You can use a lot of Googling, but try your best. Now you just need everybody to do Anybody who joins your server to do the same thing, use Mumble. Um, have your positional audio and the plugin correct, and then just join the server. You'll be able to hear yourself outside of the server, but once you're inside Aceto, there'll be proximity chat. So I hope this helped. If there's any questions, just leave me a comment and uh, enjoy.